Hey viewers, welcome to day 19 of the last 100 days of 2015. Today we're playing Legend of the Golden Robot. Legends of the Golden Robot is a reverse minesweeper game with RPG elements and on top of that it has a couple of mini games in it. The main game consists of you searching for treasures which are hidden in a 5x5 array of squares. You can move and dig up a number of these squares in a day and if you're lucky or good you can find some treasure to make it worth your while. On top of the digging there are enemies that you will have to deal with. The enemy fights are pretty simple and the combat system is incredibly simplistic, but it's fun anyway. The fact that you basically win every fight is probably different in the later stages of the game, but for the early game you have nothing to worry about. Anyway, the treasures you find give you gold and sometimes can be used as equipment, which is very useful. In addition to that, you can buy equipment in the shop and put additional stat points in the stats you find most useful. If you're tired of digging all day, you can relax a bit in the inn, where you can play two mini games to increase your money and experience. The dice game is pretty easy to win, but the shuffleboard game is really hard. Of course, it will be a lot easier if you play it a couple of times. The goal of the game is to find the golden robots, which I didn't manage to do because it actually takes quite a lot of time to finish the game. I only played it for an hour or so, but I would imagine the game gets a little boring if you play it for longer. With all aspects of the game being rather simplistic, I don't really see how the game would keep me interested other than the desire to finish it. But hey, it's a nice game to play, if only for a while. Hope you've enjoyed and I'll see you next time. Gigi.